It's a police chase ending in this crash in Montgomery County. Officers in Silver Spring were chasing robbery suspects who then crashed into a Metro bus. Thank you for joining us for the News at 5. I'm Leslie Foster. Yeah, what a mess there. I'm Lorenzo Hall. Right now, the northbound lanes of Georgia Avenue are shut down. This is at Burlington and 13th. Our Matthew Torres is live there right now. And Matthew, what are you learning about all this? Well, Lorenzo, we were first here at the scene fast enough that we got here that we're standing right next to this crash site. We're just within the last 15 minutes. We had the tow truck drivers here now getting ready to remove the vehicles. They've already uh, towed the uh, suspect vehicle away from the scene, but you can see the patrol car is still here. And I want to zoom in to the back of this Metro bus where you can see that dent where that damage happened after the suspect vehicle crashed into the bus. I want you to also look at video from the scene earlier because that suspect vehicle then landed on top of the uh, police car, which also crashed into it. According to Montgomery County Police, there was a robbery just around 2.40 this afternoon in the 9300 block of Piney Branch Road. That's here in Silver Spring. Eventually, though, soon after, officers spotted the suspects further north at the White Oak Shopping Center. That's about four miles from where this scene is right now. And according to police, the suspect drove off in this mini minivan and that is when the chase happened all the way down here on Georgia Avenue. So we spoke to several witnesses who not only saw the police chase, but heard the loud impact when it stopped here behind the Metro bus. On my way home, I, like I was walking and then like I saw like the police car and I seen like the, um, the gray car like speeding and then like a few seconds later they just like crash and then like the gray car gets like right on top of the police car and then like the um the gray car like hits the metro bus and like i heard like a big like loud sound like coming but i was in the back of the bus though like i could feel all the pain from the back we saw the van coming high speed and then we saw cup cars and we counted 28 cup cars following them yeah, talk about a wild scene and several of those police vehicles are still behind me right now, still blocking much of this uh, Georgia Avenue area. So I want you to take a look one more time at this uh, police car. They're getting ready to uh, remove the vehicle. You see that suspect vehicle on the bed of that truck. Now, what's the good news is that so far we have not heard of any injuries reported. Police did find the gun. We are told two people had been taken into custody. Officials have not released their names. That's the latest here in Silver Spring. I'm Matthew Torres, WUSA 9. I was going to ask about any injuries, which yeah. is remarkable when you see Look how the cars mm -hmm. are literally on top of each other. It's yeah. a miracle that nobody was hurt. Matthew, thank you.